Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is Random Guy on YouTube. In this video I am going to share with you a hidden gem that I found in the stock market. This is a company that helps organizations find and develop exceptional leaders who can drive performance and transformation. This is a company that has grown its revenue by 8.4% annually in the last 10 years and has P ratio of only 6.7. This is a company that pays a growing dividend and has a strong balance sheet. This company is Hydric and Struggles International Incorporated. Hydric and Struggles, or HSII for short, is a global leader in executive search and consulting. It helps organizations find and recruit top executives for their organizations. You might think that this is a boring and old-fashioned business, but you would be wrong. Executive search is a very lucrative, high-demand business, especially in today's fast-changing and competitive world. Organizations need leaders who can adapt to new challenges, innovate new solutions, and inspire their teams. And finding these leaders is not easy. That's why they turn to HSII for help. HSII offers three main services to its clients. Executive search, on-demand talent, and hydric consulting. Executive search is the core business of HSII, accounting for 80% of its revenue. It helps clients identify and recruit top executives for their organizations. On-demand talent is a fast-growing service that provides flexible and scalable talent solutions for specific projects or roles. It grew 33% in the last year. Hydric Consulting is a service that helps clients enhance their leadership capabilities, culture and performance. It remained stable in the last year. So HSII has a diversified portfolio of services that cater to different client needs. HSII also has a well-balanced revenue mix by industry and geography. The most important industries for HSII are financial services, industrial and global technology and services. These industries represent a wide range of sectors and markets that HSII can tap into. HSII also earns its revenue from different regions of the world, which reduces its dependence on any single market or sector. The majority of the revenue comes from the Americas, followed by Europe and Asia-Pacific. Now let me show you why I think HSII is undervalued and has a lot of upside potential. The blue line shows the quarterly revenue in millions of dollars. You can notice that the last quarter revenue was lower than the same quarter last year, but higher than the previous quarter. This is quite impressive since the first quarter is usually the slowest quarter of the year for HSII. This suggests that the business is bouncing back after two quarters of revenue drops. The black curve shows 8.4% compound annual growth rate, which I think is a reasonable assumption that can be extended into the future. If we account for some seasonality, we get the orange curve and these projections. $271 million for Q2 2023 and little over $1 billion for the full fiscal year 2023. The Q2 projection is consistent with the company's guidance of $260 to $280 million. The revenue growth is driven by both organic and inorganic means and it is faster than the industry average and reflects HSII's strong market position and reputation. Next, let's look at the operating and gross margins of HSII over time. On average, the operating margin is increasing over time, which means that HSII is becoming more efficient and profitable. However, the gross margin is decreasing, which means that HSII is earning less revenue per dollar of cost. This is due to the fact that the higher gross businesses have lower margins. I expect these trends to continue in the future. On the EPS chart, there are some spikes that do not reflect the company's operating performance. For example, the 2020 earnings decrease was due to impairment charges and restructuring charges. If we ignore these spikes, we can see that the business is strong and stable. Based on my future revenue and cost estimates, these are my projections for future earnings. $1 per share in the next quarter and $3.75 per share for the full fiscal year of 2023. The share price reached its highest point in 2021 with nearly $50 per share. Since then, the share price has plummeted by 47%. This seems unjustified to me, since the stock is very cheap here. 
the trailing 12 months PE ratio is at 6.7 and forward 2023 PE at 6.4 based on my previous estimates. However, the PE ratio does not seem to be a good timing tool here. The price to sales ratio is at 0.5. I plotted the 0.5 line on the graph and marked the share price red every time the PS ratio dropped below 0.5. These points look like a great opportunities to me. Do you see what I see? Do you see the bargain here? HSII has a strong balance sheet with no debt and plenty of cash on hand. The company also pays a quarterly dividend of $0.15 per share which translates into yield of about 2.4%. The payout ratio is extremely low at only 15%. This means that the company can easily afford to pay its dividend and still have enough cash to invest in its growth or make acquisitions. How do you like that? How do you like getting paid while waiting for the stock price to go up? To summarize my investment thesis. HSII grown its revenue by 8.4% CAGR in the last 10 years and I expect the growth to continue. The company is very profitable with PE of only 6.7. While the analysts are expecting a slight decline in 2023, I think the growth can continue. The price to sales ratio looks like a good timing indicator for this company and at 0.5 it looks like a good buy here. The company has a solid balance sheet and growing dividend. This is a hidden gem that I think will shine in the future. What do you think? Do you agree with me? Do you want to join me on this journey? Now let's see how my portfolio is doing. The last week was like a roller coaster ride. Nasdaq keeps doing well. Russell 2000 continues to get hammered and small caps keep providing buying opportunities. My portfolio is doing very well with 12% or $113 gain, which is slightly better than Nasdaq's $108 gain. As a reminder, these charts track S&P, Nasdaq and Russell 2000 indices as if we invested $100 into them each week and I use them as a benchmark for my portfolio. Today I am adding $100 of shares of HSII into my virtual portfolio at the Friday's closing price of $25.06. The full portfolio table is published at the end of the video. Now let me remind you that I am just a random guy on YouTube and not a financial advisor and this video is not a financial advice. Even though this is only a virtual portfolio, I do own shares of HSII in my real stock portfolio. For those of you who are still watching, thank you for your time and attention. I appreciate your support and feedback. Here is an average price change of all of my positions, X amount of weeks after the purchase. You can see that the average goes up over time and so far my strategy looks like it's working. And here is the full portfolio table with each week's prices. You can see how much I invested in each stock and how much they are worth now. That's all from me. Thank you for watching and see you next week.